everybody welcome back to the gaming network i am air and we are back over here on our town hall 7 let's play um guys i got some bad news today um we're gonna get into that but first of all let's just hop into this episode i have three builders available i have a laboratory available and my goal for today is to at least get all three of my builders building um i would like to get the Barbarian King going up to level 2, however, I need another like 6500 Dark Elixir, which, I mean, I guess in reality it is possible to do in a couple attacks, but I'm not really that, um, that like determined that we're going to be able to get that this episode. Um, hopefully next episode we will, but we'll see where today leads us. Um, however, we do have an army trained up, I have an army back behind it, we got some Clan Castle troops, and we also have a couple events going on that, you know, there's still like three days left of each of them, but, well, there's 15 days left of that one, so we got plenty of time. But the Mage Rage is must use 10 wizard troops to get 500 experience points, 30 gems, and a research potion. And then for the Naughty or Ice event, you have to use 10 Ice Wizard troops for 500 experience points, 80 gems, and two hero potions, which actually on this account wouldn't be too bad to have just because my king isn't maxed and it is still just level one. So we're gonna work on that. Uh, we're gonna see what all dark elixir that we can get. Hopefully we can get a good bit. I need to get a different base design. Um, but yeah, let's hop out here and try and find us a base. And yeah, we'll go through all of the news that I have. Um, so while we're searching, I'm just going to get right into it, and once we come into a base, we'll pause and do an attack. But anyways, so yesterday I logged into Clash of Clans, and I tried to get onto my main account, which is my Town Hall 12 account, error, and it will not let me log into it. Um, I can log into all of my other accounts except for that one, which to me is a big deal because that is my main account. I've been playing that account since 2012, um, whenever the game was released, and that is the only account that I've really ever spent money on. Uh, I've spent money on other accounts, but nowhere near the amount that I've spent on air. And yeah, so at first I thought it was a supercell issue, so I sent a ticket into their support team. I haven't heard anything back from them, but that's just because I'm assuming it's the weekend. Um, but anyways, I sent a message in to them, so hopefully they'll get back to me with some information. But I tried logging into another game today, this morning, with the same like email and all that kind of stuff, and it wouldn't let me log into another game either. So... I kind of figured at this point that it's not a supercell issue and it's more so of a Google Play issue or a Microsoft issue. So I got onto Microsoft and did the whole recover my account thing and yeah so apparently the information I provided isn't close enough or whatever so I have a feeling they're going to be getting a phone call from me tomorrow. I'm hoping to get that account back but yeah, so the past couple days just haven't been that great for me. I haven't really been in the mood to do too much. Um, I really don't want to lose my main account. If I do, that's going to be heartbreaking. And yeah, like, I, I don't even know. Right now, I'm a little stressed out about it. I know it's just a game, but I mean, let's, let's be honest here. Like, I've been playing this game now for a long time, and I've invested quite a lot of hours in, into this game, as well as you know money and yeah i really don't want to lose this account um yeah so I, i'm just kind of you know just trying to stay with it i have other accounts um but yeah like i really do not want to lose my main account that is just not something i want to happen um but yeah that's the bad news that i have um and i know i haven't featured that account on this channel that much but at the same time, like I said, like that is my main account. That is the account that I get on. I do everything with. I get the season pass on it. I, you know, my heroes are level 60 queen, level 56 or 57 king. And yeah, it's just, I, I don't even know what's going on. I don't know what all to do, what all to say. Like, I'm just hoping everything works out in my favor and I can get this account back in the next day or two. I'm hoping this week I can get this account back, get it all figured out, get everything taken care of, and hopefully everything will be back to the way it was in, you know, come the middle of the week. 
and who knows maybe I'll put out a video on that account but we'll see um, anyways guys we just did a live attack here as I was explaining that um, I'm actually surprised we were able to three star it but looks like we're going to we got some decent loot wasn't anything special uh, definitely wasn't anything special in the dark elixir department uh, we only came out of that with like 700 dark elixir but it is what it is like I said I, I wanted to explain that um, and yeah so I'm, I'm just kind of down right now so bear with me uh, like I said I know it's just a game but it, I don't, I don't, this is like the only game that I really ever play other than you know Minecraft on my computer but this right here is the game that I've played for the longest um, but anyways back to the game uh, there we go we got a three star 100% we got 189,000 gold 321,000 elixir and like I said 705 dark elixir 18 trophies so not a bad start to the day not a bad start to the episode let's get it over here and we even got the start bonus so that works out perfect um, and I have an army trained up, or I have an army set here that has 10 giants, 10 wizards, 10 ice wizards, 4 wall breakers, and then 20 barbarians and 20 archers with 7 golems, or goblins. Um, pretty much the same army that I'm using now, however it just doesn't have as many barbarians, and it, I also included a rage spell. Um, it does cost a little bit more, 4,000 elixir more, which I honestly thought it was going to be higher than that, but it is what it is. So we're going to go ahead and get that army trained up. Now, the next army that we have up is the same exact army that we just used. Um, actually, no, it's not. It's got like 20 less archers, yeah. Um, but that was just a mess up on my end. Um, anyways, yeah, so we're just going to hop right out here, right into another attack. So let's see if we can find us a base pretty quickly, and we'll go ahead and smack it right in the face. Um, anyways, guys, let me know down in the comments. Um, how's your weekend been? Um, you know have you guys been having any issues i know there's been a couple comments in my chat that um their game's been crashing a lot since the town hall 13 update now i don't know if it's because i know i've i've had that issue in the past where my account or my game would crash but that was just due to me not updating the game so i don't know if that's the reason i did say something about it to them in the chat so hopefully they'll get it figured out um i know there's been a lot of issues with the game since the Town Hall 13 update, but hopefully it all gets worked out. Like I said, hopefully I get my account back and everything gets back to normal. Um, also, check down in the description. I set up my Discord server to where you guys can now join the server and there is a special chat server inside of it that is for YouTubers or for, you know, like the followers that I have here on YouTube. So if you want to join up, please feel free. The link that's down in the description, it won't expire. There's no maximum limit to how many people can use it. Uh, go ahead, feel free to join up my Discord and you know you'll be able to keep in touch with me. Um, you'll be able to chat and yeah, I don't know exactly where it'll go, but you know, hopefully you guys can join up and we can have a good time. Uh, you know, maybe I'll be able to get some replays or something, let you in the, into the clan, you can share some replays, maybe I can feature them on the channel, you know, who knows, um, something that I figured I'd experiment with, and we'll see where it goes, so, I'm actually kind of after more elixir, so I think we're going to skip that base, don't really need, the, I mean, I need the gold, but I'd really like to get more elixir than what that base had to offer, so, I think what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go ahead and cut the video, and I will be right back with you guys as soon as I find that perfect base. Alright, guys, here we go. We got 285,000 elixir up for grabs. It is a Town Hall 6, so I do feel a little bit bad, but at the same time, I need these resources. So, we're going to go ahead and crush this base real quick, and hopefully have enough time to do... One more attack, maybe two more, we'll see. Um, but anyways, it looks like most of their resources are going to be in the collectors. Um, so with that being said, let's see, will these archers get sniped by that mortar? Doesn't look like it. All right, so they can go ahead and chill out down there. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and send in a line of barbarians right here for the time being. We're gonna get the giants in behind them and go ahead and drop down my wall breakers. We're sending an a line of archers with a line of wizards back behind. Go ahead and get an early heal spell down and send in the rest of the barbarians just like so. Um, I don't, I'm not gonna need my hogs. Um, if I do, then there's something wrong with my attacking. But 
We'll see. Um, let's go ahead and get another heal spell down right here. Looks like the majority of the troops are going that way. And that archer tower is busy, so we'll go ahead and send the goblins in right here. Right at the top of the base, go ahead and clear out all that. And that cannon's busy as well, so we'll just go ahead and launch the rest of my archers right here. Just to clear up, and then I don't like taking spells back with me, so we'll just go ahead and drop this heal spell right here, just to get that king healed back up to full health. And yeah, so that's going to be an easy three star for us. Pretty much an easy 300,000 elixir, and yeah, so that wasn't bad at all. We got ourselves another three star. Like I said, 271,000 gold, 285,000 elixir, plus that small little loot bonus of 3,700 a piece. So just under 300,000 elixir, but it's better than that first base that we found. Um, yeah, so we got another star bonus available. I think what I might end up doing is going ahead and cutting the video, waiting for this army to finish, and I think we're going to do one more attack, so uh, give me just a second guys, let me get this army finished training, and I'll be right back with you guys as soon as I find another base. Alright guys, we got ourselves a Town Hall 8 here, so this should be a little bit challenging, which is good, I like a challenge, but we are rocking the new Ice Wizards, well for the meantime, um, but again, this shouldn't be a bad base because all of their loot seems to be in their collectors, so with that being said, think and since we're after primarily elixir and the dark elixir well first let's go ahead and get some troops down on those corner huts um yeah so they got their dark drill over here so yeah let's go ahead and we're going to put down the line of barbarians we're just going to send our giants in right here with the archers back behind them and the ice wizards back behind them with our king and a heal spell. We're gonna go ahead and send in the wall breakers and drop in a couple more regular wizards right here. Now we are going to use our hogs, but I do want to see which way the troops decide to go. Okay, so they're going this way. So let's go ahead and send in our hogs right here. And let's go ahead and rage up all of these troops. We're going to get a heal spell down right here that will get the hogs and all of the other troops and let's go ahead and send in our goblins just like so we'll go ahead and drop down another wizard just to help out and this attack's actually going pretty well considering the fact that it's a town hall above ours um will we be able to get the three star though that is going to be the issue um however it looks like I still have three hogs that are pretty much all full health, so... I don't know guys, this is looking pretty good. Um, let's go ahead and get these wizards down here for some cleanup. That's all the troops deployed. And we only have two more defenses after that cannon, which is the bomb tower and the wizard tower, so... And it looks like the bomb tower focused on the archers first, so that's pretty damn good in my opinion. And then the hogs, go ahead and take out that wizard tower. And final building. There we go guys, that was actually a lot easier than I expected it to be. Uh, we got ourselves 316,000 gold, 268,000 elixir, and we actually got some dark elixir in that raid. We got 474 dark elixir, so that got us just under 500 dark elixir, closer to getting a level two king. So, and we got another star bonus. Look at that. Resources just flying in from everywhere. Now this is going to fill up our gold storage, so that is absolutely wonderful. Um, so let's hop over here to the progress base and see what all we can get done. Um, I would like, like I said, I would like to get something going in the laboratory. Um, this hasn't worked in, couple, in a couple days, so what have I been using the most, really? Should I do my spells? I kind of feel like I should work on my spells. Um, and I'm kind of thinking about the heal spell, just because that is pretty important. My giants are maxed out, my wizards are maxed out, my laboratory is maxed out, so that is the highest that they can go. Um, yeah, so I'm thinking the heal spell. Let's go ahead and take this up to level 4, guys. Um, so it's a 3 day long upgrade, so it's not going to be very long. It's a 1.2 million elixir upgrade, and it's going to level 4. So in 3, 2, 1, down it goes. And we actually have a book of spells. And we have 775,000 dark elixir left. Oh, excuse me. Um... Hmm. So I could actually finish that and then go ahead and get like the barbarians up 
or even the archers to be honest well no i want to leave myself some elixir for another army because i haven't trained up another army yet but this is only a three day long upgrade so i think what i'm going to do is i'm just going to hold off on that book of spells we'll get that we'll use that on a later upgrade but um yeah, so I want to get this armor camp up, so that I think is going to be one of the upgrades that I do. So let's go ahead and drop that down. It's a five hour long upgrade. It costs 100,000 elixir. So I'll have to get back on here later on today and try and get it upgraded to level five. So down that goes. And I think for the rest, actually, let's go ahead and get another army train just real quick. So I know what exactly I'm working with as far as resources go. And I have a barrack here that is level 2, so I think this is definitely going to get upgraded. Now, oh man, I really have no more walls left to upgrade, do I? I do not. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. So literally, all of this gold is pretty much going to start getting wasted. Um... I did not expect that to happen. All right, let's see here. So I kind of feel like I need to spend some gold. But at the same time, I do really want to get these. Wait, can I upgrade my clan castle? No. Damn, so everything up here really is maxed out. Oh, man. Um, all right, guys. What can I spend some gold on that's going to take away quite a lot of it? Actually, I guess the better way to do this would be coming into here. So it looks like the most expensive thing is going to be these... Or no, the air sweepers actually are more expensive. So, should I go ahead and drop this down? It's a one day long upgrade. It's one, one and a quarter million gold. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Because I want to get rid of some of this gold. Um, so yeah, let's let's go ahead and upgrade this air sweeper to level 3. It's a one day long upgrade. It's 1.25 million gold in 3, 2, 1. Down it goes. Now, I'm not exactly sure what level max level is with that so we will have to wait and see in a day to find out if that's maxed or not um now like i was saying i do want to get this last barracks upgraded that will definitely help out with the troop production but at the same time i wouldn't mind working on these smaller defenses like these newer ones that i just put up in the last episode um so i think well actually let's go ahead and do air defenses because those are actually pretty important at town hall 7 so let's go ahead and get this one up to level 2 a while it's a 12 hour long upgrade it's 90,000 gold definitely not enough gold that i really want to spend i honestly didn't think i had finished all of my walls but looks like i did so we got to work with what we got guys um so yeah we're going to go ahead and take this air defense up to level 2 12 hour long upgrade 90,000 gold in three two one down it goes so there we go we got all three of our builders working um maybe i should see i really want to get the second builder or the fourth builder and i could afford it that would leave me with 300 gems i think i'm gonna hold off on that maybe we'll do it next episode maybe we won't we did get some of the season pass rewards and that gave us more gold go figure I'm not going to collect that just because i don't really need it um anyways we're gonna hop back over to here Hey guys, do me a favor. If you like this video, please go down there and give this video a thumbs up so I know that you liked it. It motivates me to continue making these videos for you guys. I enjoy making them, so I'm probably not going to stop regardless, but it definitely helps out if you hit that like button. Also, please subscribe, or yeah, please subscribe if you're not subscribed already. It really helps me out and promotes the channel. Um, also, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of the episode. And don't forget, if you would like to join my Discord server, information is down in the description below and just like that guys this video is over and i'm out yeah